Hi, I'm Navid Ansari and in this video we're gonna talk about circular health bar. So without any further ado, let's begin. <laughs> For that, let's just create another project. Let's call it Circular HP and hit save. And in here, like most of my video, I did create this script to make it easy for you to have that health bar in your project. So if you go to Marketplace, open Marketplace, you can add this Circular health bar to your account. So search for Circular health bar in Marketplace. I did upload it and add it to your account. This video is thanks to David from davetech.co.uk i will put his site link to description down below he's the coolest believe me he done a lot of good stuff with surfaces i asked him to if i have the permission to use his stuff and it's he said he said yes and thank to dave we have this video here as well so after this video we will go through his content and i will explain everything to you so know that we add this health circular health bar to, to our account we can go back to our game maker and in here in my library just, just refresh it and you can see the circular health bar is here we should download it and after that just add this script to your project and that's all you need to do Hit import and close this library and everything should work fine and if we go to this script you can see that there is two function in here one function for draw circular with fill with circle fill in it and another one draw circular hp and i will show you both of them so now that we have these uh, two function we we can create an object to use this uh, script so let's just create an object let's call it obg hp and in here just add a draw event draw gui or draw it doesn't matter which one you use in both it will work and in here we can say draw circular fill hp you can see it has some input so for the first input is x and second in input is y and the value is the amount of health that remain for the player so in this case i want to say 45 and the max value of our health is let's say 100 and the color that we want to set i want to set green and for the radius how big it is we let's just say 50 and for transparency i want to say one so now that we use this function let's just add this obg health to our to our room now that we add it wherever we put it it will create a circular health bar so now let's just run it and you can see this is our health bar so let's just do something with it if we go to workplace in here in in mouse in left pressed we want to say whenever they click um, let's say decrease the health so let's just create an hp in here hp let's call it my hp and i want to say that is 100 for now and in draw function instead of just saying 45 i want to say my hp and in left press we want to say my hp equal to my hp minus 10 so whenever we click it should decrease our hp by 10 but let's just change this left press to global left press by going to add event most in global global left press and instead of just putting putting it in here just put it in global left press and now we can delete this left press in here now let's just run it and now whenever we click on this button our health bar will decrease the next type of this circular health is just draw circular hp it's be empty at the inside of the circle so it has another input at the end that is the width i want to say the width of this circle should be 10 and i will show you what is this width is so let's just run it and you can see the width is here to here and i put 10 in here now whenever we click you can see that our health decrease by 10 so if we change this 10 to 20 you can see the effect on it and whenever we click our health decrease and we can change the transparency in here like 0.5 and you can see the transparency is 0.5 you i i think you can see it but it's there let's make it like 0.8 again run it and you can see that is here the background is black so you can see the transparency right but you can use this in your game easily it's easy to use and it's ready and you can see the codes that are doing this if you want to know more about it you can go to dave's site in the description down below so 
hope you enjoyed this video please if you like this video hit that subscribe button like button bell button if you like thank you very much for watching bye